Okay, you know, it's been uh, about two, a little over two weeks since I received Optimus Prime with the new battery pack, and uh, it has already done uh, 6,000 kilometers, uh, about 3,700 miles. So I should do something that I forgot to do uh, with Optimus Prime before, which is to measure the battery pack. So you know, there are many ways to measure it, but uh, this uh, this method is what I consider is uh, one of the more like uh, useful ones, which is to charge the car to 100 percent and then slowly discharge down to uh, close to zero, not going to run all the way to zero. And then we could just estimate the remaining. Uh, so by doing this, uh, oh, 100 percent now, um, we can measure how much what we want to see is how much energy we get out of the battery pack. Uh, a new one, a new 90 pack should have about 80 kilowatt hours available. Uh, you see, we are already at 100%. Well, uh, the BMS claims 100%, but we are still charging at 10 kilowatt. So we're gonna stay here for a while. Uh, we probably have to sit and wait another 10, 15 minutes until it stops. Uh, maybe I will stop earlier if uh, if the power goes goes down to like one kilowatt because I know it takes freaking forever for the last part. Yeah, but uh, we're just gonna wait a little bit more uh, until it stops or almost stops and um, then we're gonna drive. Uh, we'll probably drive like 400 something kilometers. I will try to do an eco run, so range mode is on. I will drive at maximum 80 kilometers per hour. We have more away here, so I'm not gonna be in the way for anyone. And the reason for that, for the eco run, is that, um, oh, heater will be on by the way, is that I want to have somewhat low consumption. If the consumption is too high, you get more heat loss in the battery. And that is not measured in this uh, trip meter. Yeah, so uh, it's gonna be a long uh, test, but uh, I want to know this. Okay, we have been <laughs> sitting at 100% for a while. Uh, I didn't catch the time, but at least 10, 15 minutes. And we're still putting in something there, but you know what? I noticed that this number, 379, has stayed there still for a long time. So we're gonna see the same thing we saw in Millennium Falcon uh, in the old days when it was kind of fresh, which is that uh, once you start driving, the the kilometer here doesn't uh, doesn't go down, and uh, but we still consume energy. So basically, uh, this one will stay there, and then we consume energy. Yeah, I'm gonna see if it happens now also, but I'm pretty sure that will uh, be the case because. Uh, I don't know, it seems like the BMS is learning where the minimum and maximum points are right now. Uh, when uh, the battery pack comes from the factory, it just has a standard value within some... Uh, I mean, of course, they have some margins just to make sure that you know, people don't run out of juice with a new car. But eventually, yes, the, the BMS has to be uh, recalibrated when, when you know, the battery pack starts uh, aging. Okay, uh, this is taking forever uh, I look at uh, the display and it says I've been here one hour and ten minutes charging from 88 to 100 ish percent so now I'm just gonna take a shortcut here uh, we are charging at only 1.2 kilowatt now see this times that so uh, I think that's good enough <laughs> We're just gonna stop uh, it's like very close to 100 percent so it's probably doing some balancing to try to push in uh, slightly more energy here, but we're, we're just, this is good enough. Uh, there was like, in the total, it won't count that much, maybe like uh, a few, um, uh, 0 0.1, 0 0.2 kilowatt hour more. Yeah, so let's go then. Okay, we are finally up and running. Uh, so the first indication we can see that the battery pack is fairly full is this. You cannot put in more energy than, uh, yeah. Then there is enough space there, to put it that way. And um, you see, 379, that's what they've been sitting at for a while, and uh, we have already consumed 0.7 kilowatt hours. That's about three kilometers. Yeah, now it's getting close to four kilometers, I'm typical. So, uh, this is uh, what you can expect from a new pack. Yeah, let's see how long it takes before uh, that, that number actually goes down. Oh yes, finally. So after 2.2 kilowatt hours, it start dropping. So that equals to 10 kilometers. So it should have been, it should have been 390 kilometers roughly. Yeah. All right. Now let's drive it down to almost zero. 
we have been driving for uh, almost an hour and uh, this is some weird shit man okay do you see something weird here oh probably shit okay we have consumed 10.5 kilowatt hours and we are still at 90 percent so see, according to this estimation here, we have 100 kilowatt hour available. <laughs> no, that's not the case. So that's why we have to drive it down to zero, well, almost to zero, uh, to find out how much energy we can really get out of it. Okay, that's Espa with the world famous Espa buns. I will say nay to buns right now. We are, we are on a mission here. Okay, we're getting close to Hama and the numbers have even out a bit. So now we're down to 80% and uh, according to the estimation now, we will get 90 kilowatt hour out. Uh, so that will most likely also drop by the time we get down to zero. So uh, it should be, you know, around 80 kilowatt hours. We shall see. Uh, okay, I had a very poor excuse. I had to go to the restroom. Uh, so I stopped here and I bought some buns at the Bolelan. Yes, uh, but anyway, that was a quick stop. Uh, we haven't refueled, I mean, we haven't reduced yet. So we're just gonna hammer it ish, hammer down the road. So far, we have done, let me see, let me see, uh, just here. 151 kilometers and already, well, 68%. All right, let's go. Oh yeah, freaking Espa buns, man. Oh, nice and warm. Uh, and also brought some Hawaii. Oh, 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 I'm just gonna dig in now. We have been driving for, I don't know, lots of hours. And, um, there. 205 kilometers so far and we still have 55% left <laughs> so we can make 400 probably 450 kilometers that's pretty nice so right now we are around Yesheim and uh, we are heading for um, a nimber task near Horten yeah I don't know the, the navigation wants me to take the ferry but I will take the other way this side yeah so uh, I figured, you know, since I'm already going here, a long trip, I might as well pick up and deliver some uh, tasks. We are passing by Oslo. Uh, first half is finished, at least barrier-wise. We consume 50%, we have 48 left. And, uh, well, I can't tell yet how much we have to drive there and back, but there are lots of fast charge on the way, so we're just gonna stop when we get close to zero. Reflection of Optimus Prime. Oh shit! Uh, what the heck? I just followed the GPS and it said I was supposed to take this route. It just what? Uh, that's not a road. Uh, what? Oh man, freaking GPS! Uh, hold on, let me. Let me. I'm gonna do a flip mode here. So, you know what? I'm gonna turn around. As, as I'm really happy I don't have the trailer with me right now. Oh, man, this happens too many times that the GPS will tell me to go this weird route. Oh, I mean, I could of course try to go off roading, but uh, that's not the best either. Let me see. Do I get another route now? Ah, there, yes, why didn't you show me it in the start, huh? What the heck? Oh yeah, um, my tests are always very adventurous. So I'm finally here, I pick up the item. This is Skoppum, which is uh, this, another word for no man's land. Um, so anyway, I picked up the item. It's a guitar, and you know, it fits down here. Yeah, I just put it there, uh, very safe, and then just close the lid, and uh, that's probably the safest place in the whole car. Yeah, even if I crash, 
it would just be smashing in the front. Well, it depends where where the clash is, but uh, yeah. All right, let's get back home now. We are getting close to Oslo, and we just hit 400 kilometers. Yeah, so 8% uh, left. Uh, all right, almost there now. We are now at uh, Sandvika and we are playing with fire because, um, well, it smells fire, by the way. It smells burn. Shit. I think something happened over there. Okay, let's use bioweapon defense mode. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Check out that uh, contamination. Something is burn over here. Shit, is that boat? Is it that boat? Or something else? Alright, usually about 10 seconds is enough of uh, the my weapon defense mode. Yeah, oh yeah, shit is gone. But, 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 back to this one. Um, we have a 200 plus uh, kilowatt uh, power limit now and that is uh, a warning that uh, we are about to run out and you see <laughs> we are consuming 77 kilowatt hours so um, this is why you have to do a proper test and run it almost down to zero then you get the correct reading so uh, it's getting close I think we will get about 80 kilowatt hours uh, out of it so uh, we are 23 kilometers away from home so uh, we will stop before that time I'm not gonna push the limit too far but uh, okay almost there now almost there <laughs> okay it's time to bail out now so I'm gonna stop at uh, Fort the Charger at Skay and it's 3.4 kilometers from here uh, no need to run it down to zero you can estimate the rest yeah <laughs> yeah I'm a chicken now I'm a chicken uh, all right so uh, almost there He has blinker on. Oh shit! Oh yeah. Okay, we have reached sanctuary, which is a bunch of Fortnum chargers here in uh, Skyen. You have some K over there. You have Toyota store over there. Uh, I think they have some Porsche and stuff over there. I don't know. It's fossil. That's not interesting. This is interesting. Yes. So I look at the numbers now. Uh, each kilometer here equals to uh, 0.21 kilowatt hours. So you take that one, you add it with a 78, and you get um, almost 82 kilowatt hours. Ooh, well, interesting. Hmm. Okay, now we have a reference number. So uh, a fresh ish battery pack, uh, at least this one, version 3, can, under these conditions, output about uh, yeah let's say 82 kilowatt hours I mean even I mean, if my consumption was slightly lower maybe we should get be able to get 82 kilowatt hours yeah all right but uh, anyway uh, I'm gonna plug in now and um, chill and uh, that's it for now then bye bye